I have been inducted into the crew of NerdFest. I don't know what happened. Yesterday I was in front of the crew, now I am. We set up all of our, well, Eric is setting up the Oculus Rift and the Wii. We've got all our board games, our speakers, our photographer. It is going to be a super awesome time. And you, well, you might be here, but you are not here now. People are just showing up. We'll be sad that you missed it. I am sad that I didn't post anything about it before. But I wasn't on the crew until today. We are underway. I can barely hear myself. The, uh, the KW Artemis crew up here. I'm just troubleshooting some software because that's uh, apparently what I do at events. A ton of people. If you were not here and you missed it, that's okay. You can come to Nerd Night on the last Tuesday of every month. Link is in the show notes as usual. Uh, or you can even speak there. Our photo booth is set up. Um, see you guys when I'm exhausted, because I'm totally going to be exhausted. Or I'm going to have something insightful to say. One or the other. Probably exhausted. I was not kidding when I said I would be back when I was exhausted. We actually, uh, we tore down in a pretty uh, reasonable amount of time, but it is still 1.30 in the morning. <laughs> no, we got finished all right. We had a lot of great talks. We talked about cheese and talked about physics and talked about code breaking. I got to see a lot of cool people. And I got to see their cool Batman stuff. Not actually, I didn't get to see their cool Batman stuff. We didn't have a lot of cool Batman stuff. But the thing that I love about Nerdfest and, and about Nerd Night is the, the, the driving philosophy is that everyone is nerdy about something. And what that means when we say it is everyone has a thing that they are sort of deeply passionate about in a way that often other people do not understand. Um, but the other way of, of imagining that, of phrasing that, and sometimes it seems that way, is that um, Nerd Night is a place where it is safe to care about things that other people often think is, like, uh, care deeply about things that other people think are stupid. I mean, whether that's beer, or cheese, or ingress, or space, or RoboCop. It creates a space where you can do that, where you can share that with people. And that is really cool. I mean, that is what we did tonight. We, we had an Oculus Rift. We had Smash Brothers. We had a ton of board games. We had balloon art. We had macaroni and cheese bar. We had talks and cheese and beer and it was basically just like a we're grown-ups and we have invited everyone over to play and we took out all our coolest toys and we showed them all off and at the end of the night we put our toys away and we go home and is that feeling of i don't know i don't know about being young but there's a kid-like feeling in it and as a kid, like feeling that we often do not get to enjoy. Because we're too busy doing other things. We're too caught up in, in the details. And we forget that there are all kinds of other people like us. I mean, who care about things that other people think are stupid. I have never done a Nerd Night Talk. Uh, I will one day. When I figure out what the hell I'm going to talk about. And what the thing I care about, um, the, that I need a safe space to share it in is. And I will see you guys on Thursday with more video games. But for now, it has been a very good day. And I am going to bed. Good night. Please tell me we've gotten like the entire... No, no, none of it, none of it. Uh, All That whole pre-show... Um, where like we nearly came to blows ephemeral and lost to the ether gone it's too bad but I suppose our friendship will live on because of it